Judge me if you want. <laughs> Hey y'all, welcome back. Today we have a grocery haul. Let's see what she bought. All right, you guys, we're gonna do a grocery haul. I have three bags like this, and I will say I'm a little annoyed because the lady who bagged it still bagged all of my stuff in plastic when the point of me buying four of these was for that not to happen. Okay, then why didn't you say something when she was bagging it? Or is this one of those times where you just handed the credit card over, let whatever girlfriend you had pay for it, and went and sat in the car? And I didn't notice it was happening until she was halfway through. Okay, then say something right then. And I felt too bad, so I was like, oh, it's okay. So. <laughs> okay, then that'd be your fault. Okay. First thing, I got two of my favorite toothpaste, Sensodyne Pro Enamel Gentle Whitening. So, got two of those to stock up. Got some more toothbrushes, which these are also my favorite. It's the Vib Vibra Clean Deep Cleaning Toothbrush. Just great stuff. I got Rarity some toys. I got Twinkie a toy. And why I say rarity is because Wasabi doesn't play with toys. Wasabi, Wasabi, Wasabi. Wasabi simply watches rarity play with toys. <laughs> it's cute. So I got this Brilliant Eyes Ombre Liquid. It is eyeshadow by L'Oreal in the color 445 Crown Gold, which looks like that. Okay, I'm not even going to get into how many glitter eyeshadows one person needs, but I don't know. I don't think the gold glitter would look good on her. She already kind of has like a yellow tint to her skin. She jokes around and says she has jaundice, but like adding some gold glitter on top of that, I just don't think it's going to look good, but I could be wrong. I got another one in Brilliant Eyes Liquid Eyeshadow in the color 425 Amethyst Quartz. Looks like that. Then I got. Okay, that color will probably look much better on her skin tone. Got some Revlon um, Ultra HD Matte Lip Color in 680 Glam Glamour. Such a pretty color. I mean, it's no HD Kisses, but whatever. And then I got some Maybelline. Uh, the Superstay Matte Ink in 270 Coca Connoisseur. Someone on my words, which look like that. No, again, same reason. I don't think the oranges and yellows look good on her. So now we're on to the actual groceries. Becky and I buy separate groceries because we eat differently, and plus we spend money differently and all that. Um, what does that mean? I'm confused. Why can't you guys just buy groceries together, like shop separately, but buy it together? And also we spend money differently. What does that even mean? And I'm pretty sure at this point they were still together, which means they were sharing a bank account. I'm so confused. Um, okay, so I got honey mustard. This is strictly just the stuff that I got that I'm gonna have. Vitamin water. This is the zero sugar one, so there's only, oh, there's no calories. Oh, <laughs> okay, for some reason I thought there was. I actually got three of those. I don't know where the other one is at the moment. I got my favorite hot sauce, which is Tapatio. I love Tapatio so much. I got some caramel Premier Protein. This is just for when I'm too lazy to make something and that's just me being honest. So every day. They also have their pumpkin spice out now, but I have realized I hate pumpkin spice. I mean, I don't like how it tastes. I don't. Okay, I'm definitely a pumpkin spice girly, but the pumpkin spice premier protein just sounds nasty. Has anyone ever tried it? If you have, let me know in the comments if it's good or not. I got some Del Monte cut green beans. I got 50% less sodium. I actually got a few cans of those. Another. I got two cans of the Rotel Mild Diced Tomatoes and Green Chilies. So two of those. 
I got some chicken stove top stuffing, really random. I saw this at the checkout line. This is probably why they put it there because people are just waiting and they're like, oh, that looks good. It's private selection caramel milk chocolate and robed pretzels. Look how good that looks. For one pretzels, 100 calories. Girl, we know you're not gonna eat just one pretzel. Give me a break. I got a beef ramen and a chicken ramen. I got two bags of this ready pasta elbows, which is one of my favorite pasta shapes. Am I the weirdo that doesn't have a favorite pasta shape? Let me know your favorite pasta shape down in the comments, guys. I got some edamame, low-fat feta cheese, this garlic and herbs spread, you guys. I recommend this wholeheartedly. It is absolutely delicious. I got a chocolate fudge brownie Ben & Jerry. My other vitamin water. There that is. I got some turkey burgers, which I love making in the air fryer. Um, it's made with white turkey, which is awesome to see. It's 65% less fat. Hang on, back it up a minute. What'd she just say? Um, it's made with white turkey, which is awesome to see. It's made with white turkey, which is awesome to see. Like, I kind of get what she's saying, but it's just the way she worded it is so funny. I got some frozen corn, some of these Simply Potatoes shredded hash browns. You guys, I love these so freaking much. They're delish. I also love this, reason why I got it. This is lightly seasoned Asian medley. So good. I got some frozen peas, just some ground turkey. I got this huge thing of chicken. It's just chicken tenderloins, which I prefer tenderloins over anything when it comes to baking chicken. So I'm just gonna bake all of it and then just have like leftovers. And obviously Becky can have some of that too because she does eat baked chicken. So Harvest Snaps is one of my favorite snacks, but they, they always have like the snap pea shape. Now they have Popper Duos. It's a green pea crisp and sour cream and onion. Okay, I'm a fan of the Harvest Snaps. I've never seen the popper things, but pea and sour cream and onion sounds nasty. I don't know. I could be wrong. Maybe they're the best thing ever. And they also have crunch crunchians. It's baked, not fried. They're red lentil snack crisps, also in sour cream and onion. Also sound gross. So gotta try those. To me, that's a healthier alternative than to having like chips. I got some fresh broccoli. I also got some fresh cauliflower that is already cut up and ready to rumble. I did get this to drink out of, just a little drinker. Literally have never seen her use that. So this is my last bag. I got whole wheat wraps in extreme wellness. Okay, why'd she say that like extreme wellness was the flavor they came in? I got whole wheat wraps in extreme wellness so I can make me some wraps because I really like the wraps that um, I get from what's it called Chick-fil-A but I want to stop ordering from there and I want to make my own so I got some rotisserie seasoned chicken breast which is one of my favorites it's becoming a food mountain and the last thing I got is some carrots so that's everything. I'm gonna put all this away. Oh my God, and I'll be back in a little bit. Okay, that looked pretty healthy. I wonder how much of it she actually ate. Hey guys, so we're going to do a grocery haul. Becky went to the store. Normally, I just show you guys like what I get and not really what she gets, but I decided that I'm just gonna show you literally everything. So, first things first, Got a Diet Coke, got Diet A&W. Oh my God, Diet A&W, best thing ever. Becky got, see, I'm not gonna do that. Actually, I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna do the whole Becky got this, I got this. I'm just gonna show you. Dr. Pepper. Now listen. Oh my God, Beck's about to get spicy. Yes, let's go back. Dr. Pepper. Now listen, let me well, explain. 
I'm weaning myself off of Dr. Pepper and my doctor said that I could have three sugary drinks within a week. Yeah, take that haters. Her doctor said it was okay. And we got a diet Sprite. As you can tell, I like my diet soda. I have about one a day. Wine glasses, an ocean blue lemonade and a southern peach lemonade. Got some real lemon, 100% lemon juice. There is a snack that I found myself that I introduced to Becky that is super delicious. We're gonna have to show you actually in a future video because I'm telling you it is so good. I feel like the lighting in here is not good. I'm so sorry about that. Let me see if I can fix it. Got a bag of these individual size chips because I do like to have a crunchy chip here and there, okay? And these are already individualized so I don't have to sit there, measure anything, count anything out. It's just here and ready to be ate. Yeah, and just because they're individualized doesn't mean that you didn't eat more than one in one sitting. Got some 100% pineapple juice and now it's blurry. Cool. A big, this lighting, I just can't. So a big thing of water a thing of milk which i'm not supposed to be holding these especially at the same time oh my god and if you guys are like new to my channel or don't know why i'm not supposed to be carrying i'm not supposed to carry up to a gallon because of my surgery and sometimes i forget that i just had surgery because sometimes i don't feel any pain and this was one of those moments and i just was carrying two gallons so i'm a little scared for that Oh god, I'm surprised she didn't title this video Traumatized by my gallon of milk. Got three Fiji waters. Boom. A thing of sweet peas. Some beach Bellini tea by Tivana. Again, this is why I need a new camera because the one that's made for vlogging focuses quickly. This just don't. Got some stainless steel straws with like rainbow little silicone tips. We got some white table covers because Becky's gonna do like this art project. Got some strawberry applesauce. I promise the next haul will be better. I'm staring at myself a lot because the lighting looks bad. Things aren't zooming in right. <laughs> This haul is a fail. Girl, no one cares about the lighting. We're used to it being all fucked up. Got some Life cereal. This is like one of my most favorite cereals in the whole entire world. Delish. We got some chicken breasts and some chicken breast tenderloins, which is my favorite. I prefer them because they're smaller, they cook better, and I like my meat dry. Got some four cheese parm oven baked crisps. Some deli fresh rotisserie seasoned chicken breast. This is my most favorite lunch meat. Pretty much the only lunch meat that I will actually have. Yeah, until wifey comes around and you eat the mesquite turkey. I'm trying to figure out what would be the best. Oh, maybe that. Becky got a bunch of paint, some um, paint brush things for her art project. Dude, forget the grocery haul. I want to see Becky's art project. Some buttery golden mashed potatoes. Judge me if you want. <laughs> One of my most favorite things lately is this creamy four cheese rice aroni and just these little prepackaged things so I don't have to measure nothing. You just cook them in the microwave, super easy. So got five of those. It's a good side to have. Sometimes I literally will just have it by itself. Got a thing of shredded iceberg lettuce. My most favorite, 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 which is the petite snack crunchers. Pickles. Oh my god. Girl, chill. You don't have to go make out with the jar. Got some mushroom flavor rice and pasta blend in a savory mushroom flavored sauce. Never heard of it. My favorite ramen flavor is the chili flavor. So we got two of those. Got 100% apple juice. Got some water flavorings. We have lemon berry squeeze Hawaiian punch. We have Kool-Aid liquid grape. Kool-Aid liquid cherry. Got a bottle and can opener. Got a 
corkscrew set and some adhesive magnet buttons. Becky's not telling me what these are for. I'm sorry, what kind of magnetic buttons? And some adhesive magnet buttons. Got two sweet potatoes because I wanna try like just cutting them in slices and putting them in the air fryer or something. And then two regular potatoes, some bacon bits, some delight Sara Lee healthy multigrain bread. My favorite Takis. I just recently tried all the flavor of Takis. And this one is my favorite, the crunchy fajitas. Progresso soups, savory beef barley vegetable. Becky picks all these out for me. I just said, get me some. Let's see. Just a vegetable. Loaded potato with bacon. My hair is crazy. I'm sorry, you guys. Chicken, rice with vegetables. And the last one is creamy potato with bacon and cheese. At the end of the night, I like to have some chocolate, so I eat a few of these at once. Does she mean a few of the mini bars or a few of the whole packages? Like these are the snack size, so one of these will last me a couple or a few nights. Yeah, I'm gonna call bullshit on that. So that is the whole grocery haul. It was very, very messy. The lighting sucked. I I kind of was a last minute thing because you guys have been wanting to see a realistic grocery haul. So I gave it to you. Again, I call bullshit on that. That was not a realistic grocery haul. That might be what you get at the store every week, but you definitely get more stuff delivered. Like, let's be real. You did not get to be 500 pounds eating chicken breast, sweet potatoes, and a couple mini candy bars every night. Okay, you guys, so Becky and I just got back from Walmart. We did our walk and we also got a few things from the store, the actual grocery part, because we're gonna have like a turkey taco salad type thing tonight for dinner. And I needed a little bit more chicken and stuff, but I want to show you what we got. We got some of this restaurant style salsa. We got lettuce for the actual salad part. I got, I was searching high and low for a taco seasoning with less sodium and I was finally able to actually find some. So I'm very happy about that. We got some more raw tomatoes. Becky really likes sugar snap peas just to snack on. So we got some of those. Ground turkey. I got a bag of this extra small already cooked shrimp from the frozen aisle. And for this whole bag is only 200 calories because there's four servings. And for a serving is 50 calories. Obviously me and Becky can't eat all this at once because I can only take shrimp in kind of like small quantities. I got two things of just chicken breast and then I also got some pink salt. It's Himalayan salt. I'm trying my hardest not to use any salt, but when I feel like I truly need just little spritz, I don't want to use table salt, so I got some Himalayan salt. Well, that's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this with me. If you did, please hit the like button and don't forget to leave me a comment down below.